Welcome back to my channel. So as many of you know, today is Force Friday, which is the day that Star Wars releases all of their brand new merchandise, which is toys, clothing, collectibles, you name it. It has been released. And honestly, I have a feeling more things will be released the closer we get to The Force Awakens. But there's just so much stuff right now that's gonna hold me over. I can't even think about that. <laughs> Last night, Justin and I went to a Midnight Madness over at our local Toys R Us where we lined up with a bunch of other Star Wars fans to get the first look at the merchandise that they were having. Uh, so Toys R Us all over the world were doing this. Um, I know that other uh, locations like Target, they were very limited which ones were open, but Target was doing something, Walmart, the Disney store. Everybody's been doing something today uh, to just showcase all of the new merchandise and show what they have for Star Wars and The Force Awakens. So last night, Justin and I went to Toys R Us, and to be honest, I was a little disappointed. I just, just from seeing what I saw on Instagram and Twitter of other people's experiences at Toys R Us, ours just seemed a lot smaller, but we do live in a pretty small suburb, so that probably had something to do with it. I just kind of expected a little bit more, but honestly, that's okay. So last night when we were in Toys R Us, we got this Kylo Ren poster really great quality and this we we both got a copy of this when we walked through the door so it's super nice I'm really excited um, and Justin's starting to like Kylo Ren a little bit more he will like him I promise it's a big debate we're having he's obsessed with Darth Vader so he's kind of bummed because it's a new bad guy but whatever he'll like him and then another item they gave us for free were these Star Wars commemorative Legos and that has the first order stormtrooper on it and we both got collections of that. This poster is super nice. We're probably going to hang it up somewhere and just haven't found a place for it yet. We have two copies, so honestly, I might want to do a giveaway. Uh, let me know if any of you guys would be interested in it um, down below in the comments. I might add that to a giveaway I have coming up that I want to do um, involving the CoverGirl Star Wars makeup collaboration, um, but I'm just waiting patiently for that to become available online and in stores. I thought it would be available today and I'm just having no luck. So more to come on that later. So the next thing that I got at Star Wars, or the next thing I got at Toys R Us rather, is this Ren action figure. I'm really, really excited. Um, I remember as a child having the same size and everything of Padme and Queen Amidala. Like, and it just kind of reminds me of the ones that I collected when I was younger. Um, so I was really excited and I love Ray. Daisy Ridley, please be my best friend, please. Um, so she was the last one actually, so I'm glad that I was able to snatch her up. People were going crazy um, in our Toys R Us. And it was only like one aisle and then there were a bunch of boxes at the end of the aisle that had some new merch and some old merch. It was just, it wasn't as organized as I would have liked, but in the end, it was a good experience, and I'm glad that we went. The last thing I got at Toys R Us was this BB-8 plushie. 
That makes noise. If I can make it. <laughs> I was super excited when I saw this. This is the last one in the store. Um, I know that the Disney store does have one very similar, but I do not think it makes noise. Could be wrong about that. Um, but I'm just so excited. I love BB-8. I think he's just so adorable. So super excited about that. Then today, uh, I had to wake up and be tired, but I went to work. This week, actually, I started a new job. And so it was Thursday, I started the new job. And then I stayed up late, went to uh, Midnight Madness, and then woke up early, went to my new job. And then right after work, I uh, went straight to the Disney store. I just really wanted to see the merchandise firsthand that they had. I had seen a lot online and just a lot on social media and stuff. But I picked up this shirt which is a little boy shirt, but they, I just really, really liked it. It's nice quality. They're cheaper than the adult shirts, which is cool. And it has the first order Stormtrooper on it. So I'm super excited. I think it looks awesome and it fits pretty well. Um, so I'm excited about that. And then Disney also was giving out these stickers and I actually collect stickers in the back of my laptop case. And then I just put this little BB-8 guy on my cell phone. Then after that, I had to go to Target because I was still looking for a few things. Um, not a lot. I, I was really trying to be good. Uh, there's a lot of other things that I really want to buy, um, but I'm slowly doing this in shifts because this stuff isn't going away, guys. This stuff is released and it's going to be coming out and restocking. This is just our first look at everything. So while I was at Target, I had to get this mug. It just, I just had to, you guys. I just had to. So I'm really, really excited. I love mugs that are like faces. Um, I know that they made these uh, back when the original movies came out. Um, I know my sister told me one time that she saw Obi one of Obi-Wan Kenobi, and this is really embarrassing, but she thought Obi-Wan Kenobi was Yoda, so she was confused why he wasn't green. Um, but she saw it in an antique store and she was gonna buy it for me, but then she was all like, I don't know if this is the right character. It was, it was a hilarious story, but that's for another day. Anyway, so this again is the First Order Stormtrooper, which I love their helmets. Um, so I'm really excited. I'm a big coffee drinker, as many of you know, and I just can't wait to have my cup of coffee tomorrow in this new mug. Then the other thing that I got, I saw this a lot on Instagram and I just was obsessed. And it's this Force Awakens t-shirt. And it's like kind of, um, what do they call that, a Dalman sleeve? I, honestly, I don't know. But I really like it. I think it looks, I like the vintage lettering and it's really soft and I like the way that it fits a lot. And um, I'm always trying to find good female clothes. Um, don't even get me started on all the awesome things that Her Universe just came out with last night. I'm gonna break the bank. You know that emoji where the money is has the wings and it's flying away? Yeah, that's me. That is basically me right now. Like, I should basically have my direct deposit go straight to Disney, straight to Star Wars. But anyway, I digress. So I'm super excited about this shirt. I don't really have, I don't have any clothes that say Force Awakens on it yet, and I'm just really excited. Love this top. And then the last main thing that I got, um, besides downloading on Audible, Aftermath, so I can listen to it in the car, because I have a little bit of a commute for work, so I couldn't wait. And I just, I, so I downloaded it this morning, and just started listening to it, and it's really good so far. It's just kind of laying down the groundwork. Um, I'll definitely do a review on that when I finish. But I also got this book. I'm so excited. It is The Lost Stars by Claudia Gray. And this is, was just released um, at midnight, so just released today, and it is the young adult novel. So I'm really excited to dive into this. Um, that's probably what I'm going to do tonight. I also really want to get the Princess Leia book, and then there's a Han and Chewie adventure. Um, I think, I think another one came out today too, but I can't remember. So I'm really excited for all the books. I'm just ecstatic for all of the awesome Star Wars news, all of the awesome Star Wars things that are happening. I just, I just, it's just crazy. It's just like what a time to be alive that we get to experience all of this stuff. I get to talk to people all the time about 
my love for Star Wars. I've, I've kind of started to build friendships with people on social media and online, just like all because we all love Star Wars and there's so much to love about it. And I just think that is amazing. So I love being a part of this community, the Star Wars and the Disney community. It's just something that I'm so proud to be a part of. And I hope that you guys are too. I hope you guys are excited for The Force Awakens and all the other amazing Star Wars things that are about to come out. And I just can't wait to share my excitement with the rest of you. And I'm so thankful that all of, for all of you that watch my videos and check out my blog. It really means a lot to me that I have your support. I just have so much fun doing this. And I love meeting new people. And I just love the opportunities that I've gotten just by interacting with other people who like the same stuff as me and that's amazing so thank you guys for watching my video and thank you for checking out my blog I what did you guys pick up uh, what are you looking forward to what are you what are you thinking about picking up next I honestly can't wait till Christmas because I know it's gonna be on my Christmas list I'm gonna be an easy one to shop for this year <laughs> thanks so much and I will see you guys in the next one bye